the most widely practiced activities of human civilization, with evidence of fishing dating back to at least 40,000 years ago. Early humans fished for survival, using primitive tools like spears, nets, and traps made from materials such as bone, wood, and reeds. The ancient Egyptians used woven nets, harpoons, and hooks to catch Nile perch catfish, and eels. Ancient Greeks and Romans wrote about fishing and recorded images on vase paintings and mosaics. Ancient Macedonians used artificial flies to catch trout. In China, writings and painted images refer to fishing with silk line, a hook, and a bamboo rod. As the earliest printed record of recreational fishing was Winky de Word's 1496 book, The Treatise of Fishing with an Angle. By 1770, a rod with guides along its length for the line and a reel was in use. The first true reel was a geared reel attached under the rod, in which a turn of the handle moved the spool several revolutions. Rods also were made better with the use of tough elastic straight grain woods, such as lancewood from South America and bamboo from India. In the late 1800s, rods made were stronger and thinner by gluing together several strips of bamboo. Line made of silk covered with coats of oxidized linseed oil replaced horsehair, allowing for longer casts. By the early 1900s, fishing rods were now made with fiberglass. Fishing reels were improved, and spin casting reels became popular. In the 1930s, nylon monofilament was developed, and in the mid-1940s, braided and synthetic lines were being produced. Today, fishing is a global industry, with millions of people involved in commercial and recreational fishing. There is also growing concern about the impact of fishing on the environment, and efforts are being made to promote sustainable fishing practices to protect fish populations and marine ecosystems.